द की पॉइंट्स आर फर्स्टली प्रोटीन यूरिया कर्स लीडिंग टू हाइपो प्रोटीनीमिया लीडिंग टू एडिमा एंड इंक्रीज सिंथेसिस ऑफ लिपिड्स कॉल्ड एज हाइपर लिपिडीमिया ऑल्सो द डैमेज किडनी में कॉज हाइपर टेंशन ऑलेग्यूरिया और हाइपर कॉइगुलेशन एज कैन बी सीन इन दिस पिक्चर अ चाइल्ड केम विथ कंप्लेन ऑफ एडिमा विच इज यूजली जनरलाइज्ड फेशियल पफीनेस इज ऑल्सो प्रेजेंट पेरी ऑर्बिटल स्वेलिंग and if the male child then scrotal edema may also be present or if the female child is then vulval edema may be present patient may also complain of cough respiratory distress since serositis or associated with respiratory infections now as you think of nephrotic syndrome let's see what all test will you order to confirm your diagnosis urine dipstick test using a dipstick having albumin marked we ask patient to dip it in the collected urine the reading of plus 3 or plus 4 indicates a significant protein urea which ranging more than 300 mg per dl another test is urine routine and microscopy rft lft in the lft the most important here is serum cholesterol and serum albumin now for diagnosing nephrotic syndrome four thing has to be remember the four things are the first is urine protein plus 3 or plus 4 decrease serum albumin increase serum cholesterol and the presence of edema now let's look at the management since in these patients there is loss of protein hence we advise them to take increase amount of protein in their diet since the chances of hypertension hence we advise them to take less amount of salt in their diet diuretics for early relief from edema steroids as a definitive management in the steroid we use the regimen for the first episode as 6 plus 6 and for the relapse as 2 plus 6 that is the first 6 weeks we give daily dose of steroids and in the later 6 weeks we give alternate dose of steroids steroid used is prednisolone which oral intake at 2 mg per kg per dose antibiotics to cover any infection now before wrapping it up let's quickly see the terms which are important with respect to nephrotic syndrome relapse we say a patient is in relapse if he, uh, there is urine protein more than plus 3 or plus 4 for more than 3 consecutive days and we say remission if the urine protein is plus 1 or nil for more than 3 consecutive days frequently relapsing nephrotic syndrome is said when protein urea significant protein urea is more than 2 episodes in 6 months that is more than 2 relapses in 6 months and steroid dependent nephrotic syndrome is said when we shift from daily regime to alternate regime or we stop the steroid and in within 14 days relapse occurs and srns that is steroid resistant nephrotic syndrome is said when there is no effect of steroids at all and that is for more than 4 weeks of giving daily steroids